Uh, Mr. Foreign Minister, my dear friend, uh, Dimitris, it's a pleasure to welcome you here in Jordan, as I uh, said in, in Arabic. We've had an excellent um, uh, discussion uh, bilaterally and with our respective uh, delegations. Uh, it is a, a true honor and pleasure to have you uh, begin your uh, Middle Eastern tour uh, in Jordan. I think this comes um, against the backdrop of uh, historically solid relations and a solid friendship between our two countries, between our two leaderships. Um, I had the honor of being uh, with His Majesty the King when he received uh, Prime Minister Papandreou in, in New York and you, my good friend, were with the Prime Minister and uh, it was obvious from that meeting, um, the uh, meeting of minds and uh, the special relationship between Jordan uh, and Greece and the special relationship between uh, His Majesty and the Greek leadership. And so. Um, um, I said in, in Arabic that we discussed a wide range of uh, uh, issues, uh, bilateral uh, relations, means uh, and ways to enhance them and to uh, build on these historic uh, relations, and of course uh, the um, um, Arab-Israeli conflict and the current uh, uh, efforts, international uh, efforts, um, aimed at um, arriving at this environment that is conducive to relaunch. Um, direct uh, negotiations and our firm position here in Jordan that unilateral action, provocative action, including uh, settlement uh, uh, building in the occupied areas, particularly in, uh, in Jerusalem, uh, where the world is united that uh, these activities are illegal and uh, illegitimate. What we need to see um, is an independent Palestinian state living side by side in peace and security with Israel uh, in the context of a comprehensive uh, regional uh, peace. I know that uh, uh, Greece uh, uh, supports this. The international community is united on this. The leadership role that we are currently uh, witnessing um, uh, from the United States is essential. The position of the European Union and your role, uh, my dear friend, within the European Union is, uh, uh, is essential. And I think that we have to pull our efforts together to try and bring back that inclusive environment that uh, uh, brings back uh, direct negotiations with that noble objective in mind. So welcome again, sir. I look forward to have our respective teams continue with the bilateral discussions and to find uh, the uh, common ground for us to uh, pursue uh, bilateral uh, relations at all levels. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. I would like to wholeheartedly thank uh, Minister Jude, my dear friend Nasser, for his warm hospitality for me and uh, all the members of my delegation and uh, our in-depth uh, discussion. May I stress this uh, once again that uh, for me it was uh, most natural to start uh, my visit to the region by coming first to Jordan, to Amman. This does not only reflect the excellent level of uh, our bilateral relations, but uh, it also shows uh, the appreciation we have, not only Greece has, but the whole international community for the role of uh, Jordan and uh, personally also of uh, His Majesty in uh, the uh, efforts for uh, seeing everlasting peace and stability in uh, the region. So for me it was uh, more than uh, natural to come first here to hear your views and uh, to hear how you think things are going and uh, to also ask for your advice. Uh, Today we signed also a memorandum of uh, political consultations uh, between our two countries and I think we are making an uh, important step in further strengthening uh, our bilateral cooperation. Uh, once again I believe that uh, this memorandum reflects the traditionally close ties between Greece and Jordan and uh, at the same time it gives uh, our two respective foreign ministries uh, an important tool that will provide the basis for close uh, coordination on a number of uh, important issues concerning our region but uh, also uh, the whole world. We also had the opportunity to, to discuss uh, other agreements that we have in uh, the pipeline as well as uh, business opportunities in both our countries. Uh, this is, I think, very important. Uh, on my part, I had the opportunity to present uh, the wide range of reforms that uh, our government has uh, undertaken as uh, well as the first positive results that confirm that we are on the right track and let me assure you that uh, Greece uh, will uh, come out of this crisis uh, as an even stronger state, as an even stronger uh, economy. We also touched upon our long-standing scholarship program uh, which has uh, created strong uh, alumni of uh, almost 2,000 Jordanians who have studied in Greece and constitute a bridge of 
communication and friendship uh, between uh, our two countries. Uh, I wanted to mention this specifically because uh, I really was impressed uh, about the number of uh, uh, Jordan nationals uh, who had the opportunity to come to Greece and study in Greece and this is another bond of uh, friendship and close uh, ties of uh, our cooperation between our two countries. Turning to one of the most pressing international issues, the Middle East peace process, I would like first of all to congratulate the Kingdom of Jordan, which uh, under the wise uh, stewardship of uh, King Abdullah has managed to remain a strong pole of stability and has consistently supported the peace process. Minister Jude had uh, the kindness to brief me thoroughly on the latest uh, developments in all fronts of the process, as well as the intra-Palestinian uh, dialogue and uh, I from my part had the opportunity to inform him about our efforts both at uh, the national level as well as within the European uh, Union. We also discussed about uh, other issues uh, that affect stability in our region, Iran relations with uh, Turkey, developments in Iraq and uh, Afghanistan and I also had the opportunity to brief uh, the Minister about the latest developments in the Cyprus talks as well as uh, our efforts to reach a solution on the name issue with the former Yugoslav Republic of uh, Macedonia. I don't want to take uh, too much of uh, your time. I just want to express uh, once again my warm feelings, my very warm feelings of uh, appreciation for your hospitality and invite you, dear Nasser, to visit us in Athens as soon as possible to continue our cooperation and rest assured once again that you will find in Greece, Jordan and uh, the people of Jordan will find in Greece and the Greek people always a close friend and a trusted partner. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.